very beautiful today, sweetheart? I don't know. This top annoys me. Why? It looks nice. Yeah, but I can't move my arms. It doesn't need to be adjusted though. If I move my arms up, I'll lose it. That's cool now. I just can't move my arms. Doesn't matter. Hi everyone, Cheeky Tam here and Tim. Hi everybody. I want you to try something different. Hi everybody. Hello. G'day, Cobba. Hello. <laughs> Welcome to Tim's channel. Okay, not that different. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we're going to be doing a UK taste test. Thanks so much to Brian's. You oh, have a note. No. Yep. Sure is. Hello, Tam. Hope the lockdown is finished now in Oz. Yep. Here are some more sweets to brighten your day. It's actually hello, Tim and Tam. Thanks, mm. Brian. <sighs> so let's do a UK taste test. Photo for Insta because you love Insta. Tim has no social media at accounts all. at all. I'm in stealth mode. No one knows me. Oh, hello, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> Up, we've got this big value pack of taverners and this one is American hard gum. Wow. American hard gums from the UK. Remember when sweets tasted best. Mm. Taverners, a celebration of all your favorite great British sweets. Try for yourself. And they have a picture of yeah. an old time, a sweets truck or something. Have a look in the bag. Oh, they look very pretty. Oh, bring some out of my hand yeah. to give you a closer look. Oopsie. Yeah, very nice. I want to go for this light I'm yellow going for one. The orange one. Oh, yeah. They're not what I expected. In a good way? In a perfect way, yeah. I thought it'd be one of those hard boiled candy sort of things. Mmm. 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 Having as you nailed this one. Mmm. Very nice. What flavor did you have? Want to see? Mm -mm. I had an orange one. I had this one here, which is a lemon flavor, but it's a really nice, light, how you going lemon flavor. <laughs> that one's yummy. I'm going to look forward to trying the rest of these flavors. I love the consistency of them. Flavors are really nice. Nice amount of sweetness in there and nice very, and fruity. Very nice gums. But you don't know who to give credit to. Do you give it to Great Britain because it's Tavernous Sweets or do you give it to the Americans because they obviously invented it? I wonder if they have these in America. Let us know in the comments below. Do you have these in America? Next we're going to try Barrett Dolly Mix. What's a dolly, hun? A creepy thing that lives in an attic. No artificial colours or flavours. Great value. Do you like the colour of the packet? I am very attracted to the colour of this packet actually. Oh, look at that. Oh, that's really pretty. Wow. Mm. <laughs> what exactly is a dolly mix? What I don't do they know, but look at them. I wonder why they call it dolly mix. Let me know in the comments below. We have musk mix here, so they're like that colour, but I doubt if they no. are. It's like mainly pink and white. It's interesting because they've got like, these little gumdrop things in there as well. And then they've got this thing, which I don't know what it is. Oh, it's already Sorry, in. I've already started. <laughs> what did you get? What'd you eat? Oh, it is a little bit musk sticky. I tried that one. Mm. Oh, they're very sweet. Mm. Wow, what are we eating? Mm. <laughs> they're very sugary sort of base, aren't they? I like them. It just says multicolored candy and jelly sweets. Mm. Did you exactly. try the jelly part? Yeah, I just had one. It was, it's ooh. nice. Yeah. This is something I think kids would love because it's so pretty to look at. You get a lot in the pack and it's super, super sweet. Yum. It's a bit um, Swedish though on the palate, doesn't you it? I keep eating more, but yeah. I don't know what I'm eating. We've got other stuff to try, so maybe you should put it down now. Okay. <laughs> I've got two new Dame chocolates here. One is lemon and the other one is mint. We'll go with the lemon one first. I do like Dame chocolates, don't you? They've got that, that, have you had it before? Probably have, but I don't remember. You get three in a pack. They're like a crispy toffee sort of a thing. Is that how you say it? Am I saying it incorrectly? How would you There's say that? There's nothing like a Dame. Is there any other way you could say that? And originally <laughs> they're actually from, I can't remember what country, but these are obviously very popular in the UK. Maybe they only make these flavors in the UK as well. See, oh. three bars inside. Oh, oh, it has actually been heat affected. It's got that crispy toffee like stuff inside there. Thank you. Which one? All right. Oh wow, I haven't had these before. Really? They're really nice, thank mm. you. Mm. I like the crunch in the middle. It's like a toffee sort of. Yeah. It's a little bit of like color in the middle. It's a hard caramelly like toffee thing and then it's coated with chocolate. I'm not getting a lot of lemon flavor from this one, but I'm still absolutely loving this. Thinnest layer of chocolate, but it's the right amount. How do you feel about the lemon flavor in it? What lemon flavor? Exactly, exactly. Does it matter? It's nice. No, it doesn't matter. It's not really there for me. I, I, I'm actually searching to find Maybe it Maybe it was all. in the piece you dropped on the floor. Yeah. That... <laughs> you know what they remind me of? Scorch peanut bars. Remember when they used to be around? Yeah, but they had a big, thick brittle bit in the middle. This but is what? very 
dainty and petite. And sweet. Delicate. Delicate. But whatever happened to scorched peanut bars? Let's open the mint one. Okay, also heat affected, far out. Doesn't matter, it still tastes the same. Yeah, it still tastes okay. It smells beautiful, it smells really minty. Have Just a whiff. Cook. Oh yeah, mm. yum. Mm. Mm. Oh, that's good. The amount of mint in this is right, but it makes you wonder what happened to the lemon in the other one. Mm. Maybe when we have another bar later on, we'll find it. This is nice. Subtle, it's not overpowering, so you can still get that beautiful taste of the toffee inside. The chocolate has had some issues, but it still tastes okay. Do you reckon you could eat a whole bar? Yeah. What, you couldn't? No. What? No. Why? I think that half would be enough and no. then save half for later. Well, if you saved that half, I wouldn't and get then... to have it. <laughs> <laughs> I'd like to share. I, I pretend I'm saving it for later, knowing that someone might eat it. That's so Caring. romantic. The romantic yeah. level on that. Right up there, brownie points. I've given my secrets away. I sound like Sean Connery then when I say secrets. <laughs> <laughs> He's given you secrets away. Secrets away. That one, really nice, yeah. I like that. Mm. I like them both actually. You see how lucky you are at last? Lucky you are. Lucky. Lucky. I'm sure I'm Connery, Connery is Scottish. Too. Round trees? What's it called? No, it's not round trees, remember? It is round trees. Oh. <laughs> Oh, sorry. Round trees. That's right. Damn it. Ah. Round trees. Round trees. Pick and mix. Oh, wow. It's a whole lot. Ooh. It's got jelly tots, fruit pastels, and fruit gums in it. Uh, I'm ready. Whoa! Oh, jeez. What have you done? They came out too quick. <laughs> I said I was ready. Nailed it. I wasn't ready. <laughs> we'll show everybody how good they okay. look at least. Yeah. I've gone through all the trouble. <laughs> how beautiful are they? Well, here, drop them back They're in gorgeous. the packet. I will try. All right. Just oh have your hands gosh. up at the bottom. What? Okay. I don't like that system. <laughs> You've done a good job considering. All right, let's try it. I have like five left or something. It was an accident. Surely, did hmm? you or not? I never know. No. What one would you like? There's not many to choose from. I'll have this one. And I'll try one of the bigger ones. Mm. Oh, it's hard. Try this one. Mm. Oh, you're going to be so jealous. This one's like a hard tube. So is this one. And it's got sugar on the outside. Mm. Has it? Mm. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, seriously, hun. Mm. That one is so good. I thought you had a red one, orange one. Yeah, but it's the same principle. Okay, mm. same principle, orange and lemon. I could look on the floor, see if I can find an orange one, hey? I think that one's a fruit pastel. Tim is now crawling around on the floor. I'm looking for orange ones. That one's a fruit pastel. I'm back. Which one's a fruit gum and which one's a jelly tot? Jelly tots are supposed to be softer. I reckon that's a jelly tot. Do you? Well, maybe it's a fruit gum. Let us know in the comments below. Fruit gum. That's a fruit gum. This is a jelly tot. They're little sweet sugary yeah. jellies. Mm. Definitely. Mm. Oh, yum. Yeah. Mm. That's really good. They're nice, aren't they? Mm. Thanks, Brian. Mm. Mm. Lots to love in this bag. I love all the little different elements in this. Lovely, juicy, fruity flavour to them. Mm -hmm. Delicious. Love them. This is a very nice selection. Brian's fast becoming your favourite person. I'm going to call him Uncle Brian from now on. Well, he may not want to be called <laughs> Uncle Brian. <laughs> Let us know in the comments below. Should Tim start calling Brian Uncle Brian well, or I'm, is it weird? I'm from that area, so I could be somehow related. You just never know. Thank you so much, Brian. We really do appreciate you sending us all these lovely sweets. And if everyone in the comments below could please thank Brian, because without him, this taste test would not be possible. Thanks for watching, everyone. We'll see you next time. Bye. Bye.